all right here we are again this is an update on the 2020 Chevy Equinox uh, wheel spacers 1.5 inch so the experience so far totally satisfied with the result good looking very good looking car and we're gonna do a visual inspection before removing the tires everything looks good here no vibration in the highway I drove this car almost 95 uh, miles per hour just to test it you know no vibrations at all no problem with the steering wheel so the visual inspection is good no issue so far so I told you I drove this car before my wife uh, drive it I drive uh, so far has driven like 100 miles after installation I know uh, the manufacturer recommend after 50 miles of installed you have to recheck you have to see if something is loose but I'm being careful with that end everything looks good so far the car has almost 100 miles after the wheel spacer installing so let me remove the tires now all right this is the first try uh, tire front driver side this is the inner part of the rim everything looks good here everything all right here too no issues let's see the spacer itself okay the threads are okay so I have to recheck it with the with the wrench but so far looks good looks sturdy no cracks at all no uneven areas as I told you these are not Bora spacers however I was reading uh, good reviews and everything looks fine so far looks well made right I'm using the same trick as before with the bolt as sturdy one inside of the brake disc so you can put the adequate pressure in the nut bolt so let me see how can I do this okay let's see this is gonna work Let's try that. Mm -hmm. This is okay. All right. Star pattern, remember? As I told you, I'm not using a torque wrench. I should be. All right. Everything okay. Mm -hmm. 
parts of the case. Double checking, triple checking. Okay. Center, as I told you before, perfect fit. Nothing is moving. What are you doing? No cracks. What are you doing? I'm checking the spacers for mommy's car. And they look really good. I love it. Okay, this is the second tire, front, right side, no issues with the rim, no issues with the bolt, no issues with the studs, everything looks in place, sturdy, after almost a hundred miles of use and abuse, believe me, This uh, spacers has proven to be sturdy, to be good quality so far. I don't know later. So I told you the trick here. The brand custom made only. All right, O'Reilly. So this is the third uh, tire I'm checking. Right side, rear tire. Everything okay with the inner part of the rim. Spacers is the spacer is in place. No cracks. No defects, a little bit dirty because of the rain here in Miami lately. So, everything okay? Looks formidable. Studs in place, sturdy. Bolts are okay. So, so far, everything all right. One more tire. By the way, I'm using my old school tool to check if the bolts and the spacers are okay and they don't need adjustment at all. They are simply okay with the first tension I gave when installing the first time. Okay then, the last one. This is the left side rear the back of the car so the visual inspection everything looks good so far no cracks nothing is loose studs okay no issues perfectly centered and let's see the sorry about that inner side of the rim no issues no problems at all so as I told you you also have to check by the way this is not a the tool for this but I need to show you really quick that nothing is loose here of course I have to double check with my friend here the old school so guys so far what I can tell about these spacers they look great, well made, sturdy. After 100 miles, no issue so far. The car has gained more stability. I tested on highway, on the curbs. On the highway, 95 miles 
with the max speed I tested. Of course, this is not a car for high speed. 95 is okay to test this. No vibrations, no issues with the steering, smooth drive, and it's much, much better. The stability in general. In the curves, you can feel more confident taking curves at high speed, 80 miles per hour, 85 miles per hour, no issues. I feel more conf confident now. And the last thought, my last thought about the custom-made only spacers is, well, let me tell you this. I think Bora spacers got serious competitor here. I'm planning to install spacers on my Nissan Murano 2015 too. So I'll keep you update. Thanks for watching.